Hey, it's Shelly from Best Buy's blog. I've been testing out the Red Road V17 cordless stick vacuum. The Red Road V17 is a stick vacuum cleaner with a lithium ion battery. It can run for approximately 60 minutes in echo mode and it has a lot of great attachments that you can use to clean your entire home. Here's a look at what the Red Road V17 looks like in the box and here are all of the attachments as they are taken out of the box. And you can see there that there are a ton of attachments for this vacuum cleaner and they're all extremely useful. I find that with my own cordless stick vacuum cleaner, I don't always use those attachments that often, but I really did make use of every single one of these when I was cleaning with the Red Road V17. I really love the colors they used on the V17. Most vacuum cleaners are gray, but I really do love the white and red and purple color scheme. And it's a very sturdy feeling vacuum cleaner too. Even if you lift it when it has the motorized roller brush on, it's still very lightweight and it's even lighter when you take that off. So you can go from floor to ceiling cleaning and it's effortless. And speaking of the dual motorized brush, here's a look at it. And uh, it's actually a really unique design. I've never seen a motorized brush that has two rollers within it. It's quite small. It's not as wide as some of the motorized brushes I've seen on other vacuum cleaners, but it is very efficient. One roller will sweep up dust, fine dust, and the other will work on carpets to pull up hair. Here's a look at the V17 um, as it's ready to uh, clean so you can get a better look at some of the features. Underneath the red dial on the center of the vacuum cleaner is the filter. So you just twist the dial and you remove the filter when you need to clean it. And it has two HEPA filters actually so it captures all of the particles that could potentially fly in your air while you're cleaning. The motorized brush, it actually has a light, so that's a great feature, especially when you're cleaning underneath furniture. And it has one button to changing the modes. So here's the screen, it's a color screen, and you just switch between the modes. Um, I found that I use turbo mode most of all. That will drain your battery a little faster, but it is definitely the strongest suction. This vacuum cleaner has 15 different languages it can use um, and this is the screen is where you will see any um, indication of whether your filter is blocked or your hose is blocked or something. It, that's where it will give you any area messages you could possibly have. It's a pretty quiet vacuum cleaner too. It runs at only 60 decibels in turbo mode, which is a lot quieter than most vacuums, especially stick vacuums. Here's what it sounds like. I spent about an hour cleaning my in all of my floors and a lot of different areas in my home with the Red Road V17. And you can see some of the stuff that I pulled up and this is even after I had vacuumed. I do have a couple of cats and a corgi who sheds a lot, um, but I was shocked at what I was pulling off of my carpets. That's why I think that the dual motorized brush is actually very efficient. It's such an efficient system because it just pulls everything right out. And this vacuum cleaner does have quite strong suction. I was really impressed with the suction on it. To charge and store your Red Road V17, it comes with a docking station. So the power plug will plug into the docking station and you can just hang it up and store it for whenever you need it next time. Um, here's a look at the filter. You just pull it right out and you can just rinse that clean and wait for it to dry before putting it back in. The attachments will all fit on the docking stations, so, or most of them will anyway, so you can just hang them up and they're always accessible when you need them. The V17 includes what they call a mite brush. Um, it's like a mini motorized brush head. Um, it has one brush roller inside and uh, you can use it to clean your couches. So I did some vacuuming of my couch after my corgi had been uh, sleeping on it and uh, it was really great. It actually picked up everything and I like the power that it has in the little motorized brush. 
Um, there are other tools you can also use when you're cleaning your furniture, um, especially if you have pets. The next one I used was the crevice tool. So this reaches into the cracks of your couch or other areas that you want to dig into and look how it lights up. How cool is that? I've never seen that on any other vacuum and I really, really like it. It actually kind of glows a little bit and it glows enough that if you were like looking for something specific in your cracks of your couch, you could find it. It's, it's quite bright. One of my sons actually said it reminds him of a lightsaber. I'm not sure if that's what the intention was with the design, but it's pretty cool. And my other favorite attachment was the bendable bottom hose. Take a look at how this thing works. It rolls right underneath furniture and it is so, so easy to use and makes it so easy to clean under furniture. I, I couldn't actually believe it because I've had a stick vacuum for quite a while and I, you can never do that. You're always trying to straight arm something under the couch. It didn't fit under my couch, but it did fit under everything else. And I really think that this is a great addition to the Red Road V17. The Red Road V17 isn't an expensive vacuum cleaner at all, and it has so many attachments, it makes cleaning effortless. It has strong suction, the battery lasts for about an hour in echo mode, and the unique design of the roller brush, the motorized roller brush, is actually really useful for cleaning carpets and floors. You can see my full written review of the Red Road V17 stick vacuum cleaner at Best Buy's blog. Thanks for watching. Oh.